Hey guys, and welcome back to Cameo. When we last left off, uh, we had just found this little cave where uh, Deep Blue has been kidnapped by another one of the Shadow Trolls. But before we go and delve in, let's have a little chat around, shall we? I remember Squibble mentioning Squibble. this place. He said to start by dashing into the totem furthest from the door, and then maybe there are clues. Okay. Wisdom tells that sleep's embrace is reached through counting sheep. Legend tells that counting heads will reach the shadows deep. Counting heads. Well, I mean, one, two. Actually, let's get rid of all these. Yeah, 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 yeah. If I need your advice, buddy, I'll ask for it. Have a little look around. That's where we came in. This place is gnarly, man. Yeah, we just read that one. There's a lot of heads here to count, to be fair. Any more? Ooh. I do like the fact we can destroy these wood bits and stuff. Tidy the place up a little bit. You know. Ooh. Can't destroy those... Skulls, though. Which kind of makes sense, you know. Some money. Money's always good. So, that's... Where the little bastard is. Ooh. That's grizzly. Counting heads. Can we, like... Yeah. So it's got to be something to do with these buttons. I guess. Can we? Flame on in there? I guess not. No. Hmm. There's nothing behind these things. No. Oh, yeah, I... Ah, hang on. Right, so there's one there. Right, so that's a one. That is three. That is a two. Okay. And that is a four. So, like, I guess we have to activate these in a set order. But how do we activate them? Oh, right, the buttons. Okay, I see. So, one. Number two. As long as there's no limit here. Uh, that was three, wasn't it? No, that was four. Three was this away, man. Boop. And the last one. Cool. Alright, that was random as fuck. <clears throat> Although, not really. Alright, let's go face our troll. Oh, and I found my uh, information on where all the fruits are. So, it's all gravy, baby. It's all gravy. Let's go. Quite looking forward to getting deep blue. I think there's actually two water-based beasties that we get. I think. I guess technically Chiller is water-based, but he's ice. There's our little buddy, Deep Blue. Okay, Shadow Realm. Fight both. Let's get mobile cameo. I always remember when this game first came out, there was a lot of debate whether it was Cameo or Cameo. And it does appear to be Cameo. Damn. These guys are getting a little bit more powerful. Which makes sense. Come here, you little bastard. Give me your soul. Oh! Oi! 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 Why you no listen to me? 
Listen to your killer. Boop. Right, one. I think we've got to hit them three times. Unless you have to hit them more and more each time, which might be the case. Come on, buddy. Let's do this. Uh-oh. No, 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 no. Shit. Well, I fucked that up, didn't I? Give me your soul, friend. Oh, you bugger. You little arse bandit. Honestly. Unbelievable. Oi. Come here. Oi, get off me. Stop touching. You know, you're not supposed to touch a woman. Or anybody, for that matter. Unwanted personal contact. My god. Honestly. Is that it? Nah, he's still got some. He's still got some. He still wants some of this. He wants some of this still. Right, come on, buddy. There we go. I need to wear your skin. Come on. Avoid. Yeah, there we go. Nice. That wasn't too bad, actually. We got it. We got it. Hey, Deep Blue. Welcome to the family. Deep Blue's really cool. No pun intended. <laughs> now we have more warriors than we had before. Although we still don't have uh, Chiller. <laughs> he's not pretty, but he's cool. Feel the power. But how we never got a sequel for this game, I genuinely don't know. The cave started flooding while you were down the scary well, and now the door's blocked. But hey, your new warrior should be able to blast us out of here. Yes. Why not try it? That's a little bit awkward. Well, I mean, I guess we don't have any choice. Um, let's go check out our new warrior. Deep blue. There we go. We've got like one page. Of warriors, cool. Deep blue. Now, Deep blue. let's have a little look at him. He's got the aqua cannon. Deep blue's aqua cannon technique functions only on dry land and will shoot twin streams of water. I remember that one from his jet-like appendages towards a target. The water from the aqua cannon will have different effects depending on the enemy or environment that it hits. To use the aqua cannon, pull and hold right trigger. Adjust the arc of the spray. Mm -hmm. Hydro thrust. When underwater, the hydro thrust technique allows Deep Blue to gracefully travel under the waves. Um, the move becomes ineffective on land, but allows Deep Blue to readily deal with anything lurking below the ocean's surface. Okay, cool. And Aqua Blaster. Functioning only whilst Deep Blue is swimming, the Aqua Blaster launches two torpedoes straight ahead. The torpedoes cause a powerful undersea explosion when they hit something, damaging anything nearby. Several sets of torpedoes can be launched simultaneously. Nice. Sounds pretty juicy. So, we've got drag pull. So, three plus four, seven. So, yeah, we can afford everything. Cool. Uh, info. Whilst on land, Dragpool sinks Deep Blue into a puddle-like state and allows him to drag any nearby trolls to a watery grave. How vicious is that? That's delicious. Uh, hell yeah, we want that. Get to drown some bloody trolls. That's... that's just savage. Right, Slick Jet. The slick jet gives Deep Blue a supply of oil in which to douse the enemies or make the ground slippery. Once a troll is coated in oil, any fire that strikes will result in a devastating and brutal explosion. Yeah, um, this is actually quite a cool technique to use in conjunction with ash, if I remember correctly. Which is nice. The slick jet can be launched whilst Deep Blue is on land by pulling and holding left trigger. Yep, I remember this one. This is cool. Cool, okay. Cool. 
cool, cool. I don't know what actually changed with Deep Blue there. I didn't know we could actually manipulate them. That's cool. Splashdown. The splashdown technique causes Deep Blue to dissolve into a liquid form with just his tentacles protruding. This allows him to slip easily between enemies and evade most attacks. It also has some additional uses. Snatch a nearby foe. If the tentacle is holding an enemy, pulling LT or RT will slam the enemy into the ground. If both tentacles are grasping an enemy, pulling both will, oh, me. will perform a grand slam move, knocking both enemies together. Nice. I like it. Well, Mr. Deep Blue, be all you can be, brother. Doesn't appear to really change that much, does he? Um, or maybe it's just subtle. Now he's got plenty of uh, stamina. Or mana, whatever you want to call him. Now, let's check out his alternate skins. I actually really like his colour scheme there. <laughs> That's pretty random. What? Oh, damn. Wait, what? He looks like a spider. Um. Hmm. Kind of random. I actually just like his standard skin, to be honest. But I suppose to keep it in theme, we go with that grizzly thing. Oh, we didn't actually equip him. Uh, yeah, we did. Right, let's become Deep Blue. Ooh. Gotta remember, like, how to use him now. So. Oh, God. This is. This is awkward as hell. And is it. Is his chest up there? I think. Is there? Right, that's the torpedo move. Can we destroy. Okay, you're going to have to forgive me. This is really fucking weird to control. I don't really want your advice, buddy. Okay. Yeah, we can destroy that. Okay. Yes, we've got enough money now. Okay, I don't... Oh, God, this is awful. Oh my dudes, this feels terrible to control. Okay, I think I'm kind of getting used to it. It's inverted, which is the problem, I think. It's just really freaking bizarre. That torpedo move's cool, though. Definitely a fan of that. Now, can we destroy... I'm not stuck. Piss off. I'm experimenting. There's a difference between being stuck and experimenting. No, we can't destroy those. Alright. Now, oh man, it's inverted. That's the trouble. Okay, so we can't do anything with that. I'm guessing. We're going to go through here? No, maybe not. So, I see what it is. You can see the reflection in the water above. Okay, so I guess we can destroy these with the torpedoes. Although they're very hard to hit with the torpedoes. Torpedoes away. Well, I think we saved the day. Let's get the F out. Okay, we're almost home and dry. If you like being dry, that is. The door is rigged up to the water wheel, and Deep Blue should be able to make it spin. Alrighty. So what are you waiting for? Um, I'm waiting for you to stop talking. Okay, cool. Ooh, I like Deep Blue. Deep blue's cool. Yes, yeah, the water gun. I remember thinking the water uh, you, it was like incredible as well. Dude. How the times have changed. What does this say? Uh, penalties will be incurred for attempting to force this door. Use the water wheel instead. Mountain Mining Co. Alright. Think we can do that? Yeah. I mean, the water's, like, like in hindsight, the water's pretty good. I don't think it's quite as good as um, Mario Sunshine. Man, Mario Sunshine, like, that game. 
doesn't get as much respect as it deserves when it comes in to the water physics. Like, Mario Sunshine was gorgeous. Like, the jetpack and everything. One of my favourite Mario games, actually. And I don't know. I know that's a controversial thing to say, but I actually really liked Mario Sunshine. It's set around the beach, around the ocean. My favourite kind of scene. All right. Nice. I guess we can't... Ooh. So that's the water slick. Cool. I wonder... Like, if we spray oil everywhere, and then use ash... Nah, it just makes it burn. It doesn't, like, really um, blow anything up. Can't use the water here to do anything. No. That's a shame. Now, can we go to the shop and get our max level... Welcome to the yeah, we can. Falls one -stop embarkation point. If you need it. Well, we need the rune bag. Yes, please. You, sir, have just become extremely rich off us. Yeah, 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 yeah. You're not getting nothing from me now, matey. Just literally bought everything. Right. So, we still have some things here to find. So, all the way around the entrance to Major Ruin Shadow Troll Cave entrance, across a small gap. Okay, so we've got... We've got to find the five signs. Ow! That was savage. So this is quite interesting. We've got to find the five signs. Now, I didn't actually know we had to do this in every area. But apparently so. But that's cool. So now, if I remember correctly, the signs... Well, Major Ruins was up here. Because we had to go across here to actually get him, didn't we? Now, in there was where his little... Area was... Oh, I see. Ooh. Boop. Uh-oh. Um. Um. Okay, that's fine. Oh! What? We can smash those down with Major Ruin. My dude, I did not know that. That's really nice to know. Uh, the starfish holds some pearls of fame. Search there to start my treasure game. Ah, starfish, you say. Boop. <laughs> the hover never works. It never works. Right, starfish. I mean, they look like starfish to me. Unless we have to, like, search under them. Let's get Pummelweed out, shall we? Pummelweed. Now, can we lift these guys up? No. Okay, I would have thought that we could. No, we can't lift him up either. Ah, hello. Evening. To find my sign and save some hassle, search behind the ancient castle. Ancient castle? Now, what would an ancient castle be? Can't go behind that. Do they mean the Temple of Light up there? Ooh. I mean, the Temple of Light's not really a castle, is it? But, hey, let's not split hairs. Boop. Alright, go on then. I'll bite. Let's go upstairs. Now, how do we get up there? That was, like, right round, wasn't it? That shop is not a castle. But then, that's bizarre. I really wouldn't have said that that was a castle, the Temple of Light. But, eh? Whatever, I guess. I guess, you know, these are not... Well, I mean, it kind of looks like a castle. Maybe. Can't really... Ah, yeah, it is. I guess it is this. 
Right, what have we got? Can we, like, land, please? Thank you. Uh, the lakeside hill near the wise old squid is where my latest sign is hid. Well, alrighty then. Uh, the wise squid. Where's the wise squid? Yeah, that, that hover that we learned about in the beginning doesn't seem to work very well. The wise squid. Now the deep blue is back in the whatnot, we can explore the depths of the water temple. Mm. Your Aunt Lenya is being held somewhere inside of it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We got it. We got it. I need to find some clever squid. So, you know. Um, I don't think I don't think we can like go underwater and look for signs I don't think we can is this where the clever squid was that was fun oh it's nice to be home again thanks for helping me out and good luck getting your family that's very nice of you thank you You're one of the good ones. Whoops. Hello. Hey. Hey. Later. Hey. 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 Later. Hey. Ooh. Ah. I wonder. Can we just? Okay. We can't actually destroy that. We can destroy that though. <laughs> you don't mind me just like coming into your house and destroying everything, do you? She actually doesn't even care that we're in here destroying the place. That's pretty cool of her, to be honest. Right, so she's not the wise squid. And I find it interesting that all of these respawn every time. So we might as well just like plunder them. Um, ooh. Exit from Mount Rise, operated from summit only, yeah. Well, we don't want to go in there yet. Now, she's not the wise squid. She's the one that just gave us the shits. Unless the wise squid was back this way. Kind of hoping that now we, like, left the area and went inside somewhere else. I'm hoping that hasn't like reset this area and we've got to go find all the different bloody signs again. Pretty sure it's not how it works, but are you the wise squid? I guess not. You don't really have anything to say. Apart from hey. So we have the ah, hello. What's over here? No. Ooh. These are the elemental warriors that you have rescued or been given. <laughs> Along the eastern cliff path, near the fruit on the stalk. Eastern Cliff Path. Curious. You'll never get the hang of swimming. It's not that bad. You'll be loving it, trust me. Swimming's fun. Exhausting, you know, once you've been in the pool for a few hours, but it's fun. Right, Eastern Path. Eastern Cliff Path. Hang on, does that mean it's up there? That doesn't seem right. There was a stalk up there, though, that we've already plundered. So, that might be it, I guess. But that would possibly imply... Oh! 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 Uh, that would possibly imply that she's the wise squid. 
Ah, look up there. But we know she ain't the wise squid. We know she's a bitch. So, there's that. I keep forgetting this is inverted. It's bloody horrible. Why would you invert the controls? Like, if all the controls are inverted, then fair enough. Oh my god, this is... This feels awful. There must be a way of changing that. There has to be. Um... Yeah, even though I've got it on normal, it just changes it. Like, that is so fucking stupid. That is, like, I cannot even put into words how disorientating and irritating that is. Okay. It's so unintuitive. Right. So, unless... It's over here somewhere. There is that up there, though. I don't know how we get up there. To be honest. Hmm. Oh, man. There is something up there, though. Hmm. I think I might take a break here, guys, and try and work this out. So we can't get any further out. Ah. Unless we need to take more. No, that doesn't make sense. Hmm. Right, let's. Yeah, that doesn't work. I don't know how that works. Right, let's take you. Let's see where I can drag this guy. Rubble. Right, let's get rubble. This way, buddy. Now, where can I set you up? Can I set you up here somewhere? Ah, this is curious. Ooh, we haven't been up here yet. Ah, oh, there it is. Okay, well, I guess we don't need to use anything with this. The final signs across the way. Out from the ledge where the rock, uh, the rock tea play. Okay. Across the way. Behind the light tower. Well, let's shake this down. Let's grab that. How many was that worth? It's only worth These two. Are the elemental warriors two. Rescued or been given. By the blue pearl holding starfish. Behind the light tower. Along the eastern path near the fruit on a stalk. Boulder plate. Okay, so it says use ash and major ruin to detonate a plant bomb at the rock tea column of rocks found next to a tele the teleporter gate in the western part. Western part. Oh, well, this is the western part. But where? Alright, we've got those following us. So where's this going to go? And we've got some more rocks there, which we don't really need. Can we set this guy up somewhere? Ah, unless they mean that guy there.
Which is... Ah, do they mean up here, maybe? Can we set this up? Hmm, doesn't look like it. Right, I think what I'm going to do, guys, I'm going to end this video here because we're on half an hour. Um, I'm going to try and find out where we need to set this guy up. They say, like, the western, like, part of the map, but, like, that's quite a big part of the map, to be honest. I'm not sure how useful that actually is, but we're going to have a look anyway. So, I'm going to leave it here, guys. When we come back, I hopefully would have found out where we need to set up. So, thanks for watching, guys, and as always, till next time. <laughs>